had a thing for fancy movie dresses. And when I saw the poster of the movie Red Notice, I knew I just had to make it. So let's go. I haven't finished making my pattern yet, but I do have the bodice. This is the front and this is the back. And I also have a pattern I used to make a bodycon dress. And I'll just try to take these and make a mock-up and then we'll see. This is my mock-up. This is how it looks from the back. It's not perfect yet. There are some adjustments I'll have to make, like here at the straps and the side seam. And this dart is not perfect as well. But there's one main thing it is still missing, which are all the decorative seam lines the original one has. So I made a sketch and I draw it on all of the seam lines and I also marked where the side seams connect so everything lines up nicely. And what I'm going to do now is to transfer all of these lines onto my mock-up. The lines are all drawn on, so let's cut them out. I almost forgot to draw notches onto my pattern and without them I would never be able to put it back together, so I will quickly do that. I am done with cutting out the pieces, but they are just too flimsy to use them like this because they are made of fabric. So I'm going to trace them out on paper and add seam allowance so I can actually use them as a pattern. Transferring my pattern onto paper is done and just looking at this I realize how weird these shapes are Especially piece number five. I have never seen a sewing pattern like this and If you'd want it to be easy, you would never do it like this because it's super impractical So I hope it works out wish me luck Putting these pieces together is just like a puzzle with very weird shapes, but I have the solution on my phone. I can't believe I didn't show you my fabric yet. Here it is. It's this shiny red satin and it's very thin. And that is a problem because the bodice just needs a bit structure to work. So I'm probably going to put some interlining or interfacing or something in there. But that's a problem for later. Now I'm just going to cut everything out. So onto the floor. I'm done with cutting everything out. These are all of my pieces and I try to assemble this in my head, but I just can't figure it out. I go through the steps of putting it together and then I just get to the point where I don't know what to do. So I think what I'm going to do is start with the bodice and then hope for the best. I just finished assembling the outer part and the lining of the bodice and the next thing I'll do is to sandwich those two together and sew around the edges that are supposed to look nice from the outside and hopefully I'll be able to turn it around afterwards. This was surprisingly easy. I just pulled on it and it turned around and everything worked. So the next thing I'll do is to take all of my other pieces and try to assemble the skirt.
This is how far I got by now. I finished assembling the side with the slit and without the slit. And the last steps are attaching the front and the back panel and making the lining. I finished assembling the skirt and now I have to figure out how to put this together and it's so complicated and I, I don't know what to do. It's a new day and I think I have a plan. I'm going to take the bodice and I'm going to attach the front and the back together by um, folding the back around the front and stitching across this side seam and then I'll sandwich the bodice in between the lining and the outer part of the skirt and sew it together and hopefully this will work. I managed to attach the bodice onto the skirt and right now I should be at the point where I just have to put in the zipper and hem the skirt but I tried it on and I noticed two major issues. The first is that I forgot to cut the slit into the lining and now I just I can't figure out where to place it because it's not marked on my pattern and it's just also slippery that if I try to line it up, I'm never sure that it's the correct spot. So I'm a bit scared to cut it out and do it wrong. And the second issue is that it doesn't fit. It's too small. It just doesn't close in the back. So if I would put in a zipper, I, I couldn't zip it up. So I somehow have to make another piece I can put in there and make it fit. dress is so much struggle and I really needed a break so I pimped up my background a little and I really like the green so now I can move on. I cut in the slit and I replaced the back panel so finally I can put in the zipper and hem the skirt. The dress is almost finished. What is missing are the straps at the back, so let's make them. The dress is finally finished! It doesn't look perfect and that is mainly because of the fabric I chose and the reason for that is that when you sew it, it gets all wavy and bunches up and just doesn't look that nice. So I definitely should have chosen a different fabric, maybe something with a little stretch or I don't know, just something else. But I think the dress turned out fine 
Anyways, if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And without further ado, let's have a look at the finished dress. 